Back on the ladies and gentlemen, let's play European Sauce 4 as Sylvania as a immortal, uh, not emperor yet, but an immortal king. Um, or is it a prince at this point, or is it a duke? Look, these titles all change. Immortality is forever by its very own definition. So, yeah, let's uh, not worry about the fleeting things in life. Though some would argue that's the only thing you have to worry about nowadays. Um, well, nowadays. In your current predicament, yes. Uh, I'm going to call a thingamajig for these guys to reduce the make the spot fire on the army. And I will grant you a monopoly. And then I will ask for some money, but not yet. You don't like my way out, as far as money is concerned. It's the supplies that doesn't matter at this point. Alright, so, probably get a claim, call him back, there we go, so, a dollar's in a war, could I have picked a more opportune moment, maybe they won't join in, they won't, but these guys down there will, that's fine, um, I can promise land to Mombasa, I'm not going to do that though, move me away from legalism, Question, how much army does Kilwa have? One would hope not that much. Um, maybe C, D, E, F, G. K, here we go. Okay, 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 okay. 8,000 troops. A lot of troops. Ah, it doesn't matter. We can win this, he says. And Mogadishu's going to help, so, you know, there's that. No one else will, but they will. Um, I forgot to raise maintenance, did I? I forgot to raise maintenance. Doesn't matter, doesn't matter, doesn't matter, doesn't matter, maybe. That's actually even better, That's accident that was accidentally genius. Because in a... Different world, I would have attacked them immediately, but this way. I recall diplomat. Um, I think this is the correct choice of or course of action. To intercept them there. Uh, move towards legalism. Yes, absolutely. Because we are at low morale, but yeah, that was. I just got my answer right there. Thank you very much. Why am I at... Excuse me? Oh, because of the blockades. Yeah. Um... Hmm. Yeah, so that's, that's the problem with having a coastal empire, isn't it? Hmm. Uh, Mutapa's opinion. Sure, we'll, we could do that. Where is Mutapa? Sounds like a place from Star Wars, honestly. Oh, hello. Look, uh... In relations with them, I don't care about anything else. Now, um... Jump into there, siege that down really quickly. And would you be willing to... Of course you would. Give him military access, yeah. Hello? Is that your... Yes, it is. Um, intercept them. And get wrecked. Just need to keep an eye out for flanking maneuvers right around the, the wilderness here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Siege faster, yeah. Hot disease outbreak, of course it is. They have so many ships, what, what the hell are you doing with all these ships, seriously? Well, not that it's any of my business, but you know. 
Why? <laughs> okay, I'm not sure this in my land as well, should you need it. Oh, look, a lonely soldier in the middle of nowhere. Eat it. Though, to be fair, they are at war with someone else, so they have, uh, have slightly different priorities than, than I. In that they're trying to live. Um, there's your army. Okay. Interesting. So you're going to fight and then, yeah, you know what? You're going to fight, you're going to win, and then I'll... I'm to screenshot that really quickly and ask someone whether they've seen something like this ever happen before. So, we're two enemy factions, right? We're at war with one another, but we decided... Hold on for a bit. Yeah, hold on for a bit. Take it easy. We're going to murder all these savages first, and then we're going to murder each other. See, I'd expect this to be a sort of free-for-all situation. Clearly it wasn't. Alright. Um, well, even better for me, honestly. I mean, as far as wars are concerned, this is pretty much as perfect as it gets for me. You will not see a... prettier and cleaner war anywhere else. Though, as I say that, they go straight to... Where are they even going? I don't know. I don't know where they're going to their own demise. Sit yourself down. Okay, back to the... Uh... After the hand, I'll pay a little bit. That's fine. Virtual unrest in Ate, really? Is it because of the war exhaustion? It could be. It's instability, war exhaustion. Yeah, I do have some war exhaustion. Hmm. Alright, fair enough. Uh, I need to... Hmm. Alright, fine. Whatever. Um... Oh, it's taking so long. Why is this like the world's longest siege? It's only one fort, come on. But while that's happening, blasting away forward in, in tech, and we sort of have to, um, yeah, right, yeah, we have those, ah, it's, it's here, long bowman, offensive morale, offensive shock, I think so, uh, I'm gonna go with long bowman. Propaganda, we're losing sailors. Yeah, that's important to us. Uh, wait for them to lock their movement in, and then go. Why am I on no morale? Interesting question. Where are you? You can't retreat through me. Where are you retreating to? Oh my god. Fine. Alright, question. Can I go about doing that? No? Clearly not. Alright. Peace of value. 200 and... Ugh. God, money's... I was about to say money is expensive, which does not make a lot of sense. Actually, doesn't make any sense, but if you think about it... 
and move past this linguistic barrier that has erected itself, it makes some semblance of sense. Where do you think you're going? Where do you think you're going? You're not going there. Well, you're going there, but you're not getting there. Austria's considered a great power. Yeah, that's... Actually, where am I in the great power rankings? In the absolute middle of nowhere. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. You can barely support an army worth of worth 13,000 troops. It's understandable. More than understandable. Uh, are you done with your war with Mutapa? No, you're not. Hmm. Peculiar place, this southern African region. I will... I will conquer it. Eventually. Uh, I knew that was going to happen. No, you need to get there immediately. No, you don't understand. You need to get there, though. Didn't cancel the siege, at least. War exhaustion high wall, then reduce it. We have points to s we have points galore, right? This is their capital, I understand why they don't want to give it up, but uh, this is getting a little bit ridiculous. Towards legalism, yes. Weak sweet legalism. Where are we on that scale, by the way? Uh, almost all the way. Impacts corruption minus two. Yeah, this is in this recruitment. Alright. Any minute now, it will happen. But wait, when did we say I can uh, annex you? Right now, actually, alright. Come on. A little bit more. Where do you think you're going? You're not going there. I know you think you're going there, but you're not getting there. Fuck off. Wipe. Happy to be doing this for all eternity, but I'm sort of assuming that at one point you will run out of manpower. Perhaps I'm wrong in my assumption. Who knows? I actually would be willing to accept this as a thing. Now you're gonna give me kill one though. I mean you're giving me kill one, you're just not aware of it yet. Alright, speed five. Uh you're offering peace. Uh so you will sob both of you. <laughs> Exhaustion high. Use it twice. Now going up north again doesn't matter. Uh, lose one base tax, so we don't want to do that. Yeah, let's do that. Keep sieging there, I'm going to go and get rid of that. Pest. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Faster, 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 faster. There we go. Perfect. A 100 war score. Bang. Alright. Um, now someone needs to core all this. It's actually not that expensive. Uh, though I do have certain discounts on that. Incorporate Mogadishu into our country. Yes, I will. Um, actually, immediately, more or less. 
So that's influence annex vassal. There we go. Adal has just lost a pretty important battle, a pretty important war to Ethiopia, leaving them well exposed. So build the spy network in Adal. Get ready to jump on that bandwagon. Problem, though, slight problem, in that um, they're separatists, that they are a thing that exists, unfortunately. Uh, all right. You know what? All right. We can take our time, right? Sort of. We can sort of take our time. Uh, I'll ask for a contribution from you. And, uh... You know what? I'll raise additional levies from you, as little as that is worth. And stage it. it. It sort of helps, right? Sort of. But we need to, we need to take over a doll as well. You give me a sort of like a. Uh, when, can you, when are you going to. 7.5 years, 4.8 years. It's pretty bad. I'm assuming when I core all this, that is going to go down, but. That's a lot of uh, resentment towards me, understandably, though. I'm sort of hoping to vassalize you at one point. Uh, difference in government ranks. Not with power and economic base. That's fixable. We'll change that, don't worry. Hmm. Okay. Let's go to speed five. And that's that enough. We were looking at the wrong screen. This is the one we want to be looking at. Speed 5. I realize I'm not doing much with my other diplomats. Well, actually, yeah, no, never mind. I'm doing a lot with both my diplomats. Actually, a very stupid sentence. No, I, I am. It's usually, it is the thing, alright. Between me and you, honestly. Um, what I usually do is I am lazy with my diplomats. I don't do, well, anything with them, right? Pretty big issue in that... Uh, it's mostly about doing stuff with uh, this game is mostly about doing stuff with, with the diplomats. And we've successfully integrated them right. Um this can go away. And so can this. Another mission. Conquer Degaboo, which is that thing. Yep, I'll do that. Question is when. Um, I don't recall coring taking this long, but uh, what do I know? Probably should have been drilling my military all this time. Eh. How's our professionalism doing? First, take professionalism is pretty damn important. The rest is sort of like you know, you'll get there. Um. Yeah, that one definitely. Don't really tend to develop much. The Emperor has enacted a reform. I really, really don't care. I wonder. Ah, I can't though. It is what I'm is what I'm sort of pondering about. Um is it completely, utterly stupid and impossible to build an African empire? You know what I'm saying? Like to colonize this stuff, go in here, grab all of that, colonize some of this stuff, you know, slowly. Eventually, bit by bit. Uh, and to just stay here, but it's not possible due to um, 
Uh, where are they? Technology institutions, yes. It's not possible due to institutions. Because they all more or less originate from Europe. Well, not more or less, I think they literally all originate from Europe. So, yeah. Can't. Really can't. Um, feudalism appeared in 1066. Uh, anyway. Did it? Did it? Uh, wouldn't say so. Legitimacy or national unrest minus two. Yup, I think that's exactly what we need. He did. 53 years, 39 years. Yup. Alright, go north. Our air is benevolent. Um, I got a new air, or is it? No, the same old air. That's the idiot. Fine. This too will pass, yeah? <laughs> uh, and we cored everything, so that should completely get rid of the rebels, right? Yeah, minus 12. Okay. Tech, uh, we need admin tech, but we're not gonna get... Sorry, we're not gonna get admin tech in a while. So, you know what? Let's do that. Because we're conquering so much. We might as well. Um, okay, now get out of there. And, uh, well, we'll do, we'll, we'll make some arrangement with our allies, I suppose. I get a thing with Ethiopia. I can get a thing with Ethiopia. Should I wait for it? Yes. Okay, let's get a thing going with Ethiopia. And, uh... Enemy allies, Aden. That's up there. That's fine. Who are they allied with? Those guys. Hmm. I don't want to risk it. You would join in for... Free, so do. And there we go. Question, can you sort this war out for me? No. Well, yeah, actually. This is going to be one of the easiest ones we've fought thus far. Let's uh, split off into two. And as I say that, I lose all my ships. But that's fine, that's actually the three ships from there. Eh, that's fine, doesn't matter. I really have next to no respect for ships in general, so. Prestige. Uh, yeah, it's it's a weird thing. I, I really have no respect for Navy. Is, it, is that understandable? I just really don't care about Navy. At all. I don't know, maybe I'm just being weird. Maybe it's normal. Maybe it's... Eh. There's probably someone that makes like 3,000 ducats a year by having the correct number of trade ships. Um, or 3,000 ducats a month by having the correct number of trade ships in the correct spots everywhere, and I'm just being an idiot about it, but... Eh. And again. I really have no defense. I'm looking for something, but eh, and then again, I'm not very good at defenses of anything, so... No. No. Um, Adar will see... No, no, it will not. Adar will stay quiet, sit there, and be happy about itself. I will let them take all this stuff back, because I, I want it for myself, and not for them. <laughs> that I have no intention of breaking off this siege. Uh, we can pick an idea group. Right, what do we go for? Uh, quantity. Yep, quantity. 
And immediately I'll get the manpower that it entails. Twenty-three thousand twenty-three thousand manpower. Now we're working with, with something, right? Now that is something tangible. There we go, they surrendered. Um Honestly, it's taking a bit longer than I expected, but uh yeah, overall this is this is fine. No, um get manpower recovery speed. You know what? I will for all the, you know, terrible ideas that we do have, we might be able to get to them rather quickly, or at least quicker than usual. Um, yeah, 15 towards legalism. Now. Very much like... to be rid myself of this army, which is... Putting me on a wild goose hunt! Really? You're not Sun Tzu. Stop it. You're not, you're not Sun Tzu. You don't get to do this. Brief period of time, it looked as if I will lose this battle. You don't get to tell me there's going to be a battle and then cancel the fact that there is going to be a battle. It's not a very good UI decision overall. You don't know sod them. Seriously, sod them. There we go. Now, this, this and this will belong to me. Uh, a doll become a vassal? I want a dent to become a vassal. You know what? Sure, a doll will become a vassal. A doll will give me all of its money. And that's fine. Okay. Uh, accumulate money, protect our brethren in... Jura. You want me to go to war against Ethiopia? Really? Do you really now? Hmm. How much do they have? Check. Wait around. Uh, Ethiopia, 13,000 with a force limit of 20. So more than I do. Yeah, that's, uh, we're not doing that. Thank you very much. I'll uh, improve relations with them eventually, but uh, yeah, that that's going to be enough for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. Ladies and gentlemen, please remember to like and subscribe down below if you enjoyed this video, and want to stay tuned with the rest of the series. Until next time, my name is Juggernaut. Have fun, take care, and bye-bye.